Dublin has become a hub of exciting fashion, vintage styles and young designers doing their thing. So I've dropped in on Amy Wolf to find out what's going on behind her label, The Loop. So what goes into actually launching your own brand, your own label? It's a huge amount of work. Um kind of constant, really. I did a short course with the Enterprise Board about starting your own business to because I'd always had the creative side of it, particularly with four years of art college. You kind of neglect the business head, which isn't a natural thing for me at all. And how did you develop your designs then? So what kind of, like, what kind of materials do you use and why do you use those kind of materials? I've kind of decided that I'm staying within like the realm of Jersey mm. um, because I love wearing it myself. It's comfortable, it can cut, you can really dress it up, you can dress it down. And um, this is really cool, it's kind of like uh, a more complicated tie-dye. <laughs> it is, it's um, a Japanese form of fabric colouring which is called shibori. Shibori involves uh, having pipes which you bind the fabric around, then you compress it down, you bind it again and then you apply colour. I use all materials, all fabrics which have been okayed by the Fairwear Foundation. Okay. Which is something really important to me and Fairwear Foundation promotes ethical trade and justice for workers. And we also have to ask you about this, this amazing, what would you call it? So it's a... It's like a body chain. A body chain. Yeah. So you have to see it ties around the back it ties here. ties at the back. How do you make something like this? I'm always kind of collecting all bits of chain and just kind of little trinkety bits. Yeah. So I'll often just, every now and again, lay them all out and see if something starts jumping out at me, play around on the mannequin, mm. um, and just really take it from there. It's all, it's, I think design's a really organic process. I think the fashion should be fun and some people take it too seriously. 